Tomorrow. All right, well, it seems like you're busy with something because you're forgetting to cut your son's hair. Um, this yeah, is, right. look at him. He is beautiful, but look at his hair. When are you going to cut that hair? Do you have a problem with that? No, I don't have a problem. That is some long hair. You know, I have to say, it's amazing, right? You, you cut your, some people shave the, the head of their children. Uh-huh. And people say, oh, isn't that terrible? Mm -hmm. Well, I don't even cut my son's hair. And they say, oh, my God, when is she going to cut her son's hair? Right. You know? Um, whatever I will do, mm -hmm. I won't please everyone. Right. But are you still considered the fat guy <laughs> when you go to a party or anything? Because I run into that a whole lot. I'm, I'm the fat one. Okay. So does that, does, are you the fat guy in Hollywood still? Or, or is everybody like, look at you and they're like, oh, wow, you know, this is great. Now you're healthy. Uh, do you have any other questions that are smart? Um, I didn't know that I was coming up here just now. They picked me. <laughs> I'm not kidding. They're like, he just has to take this picture in this room, and it went in there, and then they just ushered me in here, so, hi, here I am. Sue, are you part of this? <laughs> you barely hear what the fuck so is saying. So, what's going on? Joaquin, directly in front of you, mm -hmm. uh, Chris with GMA Philippines. The movie obviously is about the Joker, but it goes beyond that. It's really about um, the, the mental state he was in. Can you tell me a little bit about what research or what kind of, uh, what you did to prepare for this? Because this was really an intense performance. Um, what was kind of the process of getting into that mindset? Isn't this old news? Isn't this old news? Didn't I, didn't I, I felt like I've talked about this for six months. What? I mean, I, right? I mean, I feel like I, I, I answer these questions. These questions you, mean, you want it again? It's like a different, you want to hear a different version of it? I try and change it slightly, or what should I do? Where do you see the character going if you come back? What do you mean? Why? Huh? What, what, what do you mean, why? I just, I think there are some, there are some criticism that says, like, obviously going right into sequels is sort of just predictable and might undermine the exact reason why the film is so unique. I'm not saying. No, no, I don't care who's saying it. I mean, it's awesome. I love it. You're, I love whoever says it. Have you guys been here all night sitting in here? Yes. Is it all right or is it awful? Are you bored? Like, would, do they bring you food? Do you have drinks? Like, no, nothing? IRL Joker. Do you have some food? Okay, okay. Um, there's more space in here than there was in there. So I'm not kidding. So maybe doing all right. And um, my publicist is telling me I just need to get need to go home. Uh, thank you, thank you very much. Thank you very very much. Okay. Huh? Were you asked? Were you asked to physically transform at all as Princess Leia? I heard they. Uh, the uh, fuck is this? They did. They always do. They want to hire part of me, not all of me. So they want to hire about three-fourths. Uh -huh. And so I have to get rid of the fourth somehow. So, so the fourth the, was this before be the first me. movie or before the bronze? I made a joke. During the streets, you need a date to the party? What's up? I already saw no, that. No, no, no. I mean, you're on the cover well, of your book. You're wearing a fur, and you knew that there would probably be animal rights activists. You know, this whole Vita. interview is becoming a defensive interview. No! Uh, are you wearing leather shoes? Yeah. No, shut no, up. I'm talking... Oh. You know what I mean? I don't want to hear. You're wearing fur. You're I'm wearing not, leather I'm shoes. I'm not an activist. You're, but eating, I'm saying you're eating chicken. Yeah. You're eating meat. I don't want to hear this nonsense. Come to me with a paper belt and I'll talk to you. I to work with each other, two beautiful women. Paper belt. Two beautiful women. Uh, it's very hard to do this acting, especially on those days. What do you mean? Because of because how beautiful, beautiful you are? Yeah, because sometimes on, on those days, you start to be angry, to be furious, uh, you keep fighting on each other. On those days, you know, it's oh. not so hard sometimes, yeah, I think especially that, on those days. I think there is some, uh, some like, stereotypes, maybe, that women um, are, you know, very catty on set <laughs> with each other. Um, but that doesn't really happen on our set. Uh, Does she's it still wondering. Either? In this question. Oh, I get because I think that I, I can't tell. There's like, um, I feel like it's accidentally maybe a little bit misogynistic because it's like, you're no. so beautiful. What's it like having to no. do all that acting? <laughs> I can't tell if that's the question, but if it is, it's insane. No, um, no, well, there's two. Uh, <laughs> despite uh, no, the great hard. beauty on it's the not. show, mm. everybody is, uh, you know, professional and talented and um, this interviewer capable, is a so brazilian comedian really, um, anybody's thinking about 
something as um, meaningless as uh, their beauty when they're at work or certainly Come to Brazil, for a say. Sex symbol, which for some of your fans is kind of weird because we've seen you grown up on mm. screen and now here you are, you know, so yeah, how do I you mean, feel? Harry I don't know. Potter. Um, I'm, if people, uh, if anyone sees me that way, I'm delighted. That's awesome. Around the time of what if the rom-com coming out that a lot of people were saying you know you're really unconventional romantic lead and so eventually i got bored of hearing that and i kind of picked someone up on it so i was like what about me is unconventional does exactly like tell me and she said well i think it's probably the fact that you know we associated you with playing harry in a young boy for so long and i my immediate response was well that the male population has had no problem sexualizing emma watson immediately um the fall on the way up to the stage was, <laughs> was that on purpose well, absolutely was it a fall? What uh, 